Round Rock ISD welcomes students back to the classroom today. The district recently implemented a district mask mandate, but with a mechanism to opt out. KXAN's Caitlin Carmoot takes us inside the district's middle school, where 96% of students decided to mask up. Three minutes. It's their first time in language arts class at Grissom Middle School. So it's my turn. I'm going to turn around. Y'all guys know who it is? Logan here is trying to guess the name on his back. Give you a hint, it's not Justin Bieber. Oh, uh, Wanda. Even with everyone in his classroom wearing masks, their spirits are high. In the school hallways, the majority of students are also masked up. The principals and our teachers and our assistant principals, they know their kids. And so... Once they know that, then if they see that, that, that child in a classroom or a hallway, they know not to give them a reminder. But otherwise, you know, kids are kids, so we have kids who come and maybe mom and dad want them wearing a mask and they've forgotten or they've taken it off. And so then that teacher or administrator can give them a reminder to pull that mask back up or put that mask on. In Round Rock ISD, 3,300 students formally opted out of wearing their mask. That's roughly 6% of the district students. They want everybody to wear one when they're inside and that parents do have to have it in writing that their kids aren't going to wear one. So I think that protects everybody. At Gaddis Elementary and Round Rock, many parents dropping their kids off are breathing a little easier. And they are so precious, we're going to hug them. It's better to be safe. Caitlin Carmu, KXAN News. The remote learning students in Round Rock will not start until August 25th. The district is still working on finding teachers and enrolling students. Right now, roughly 5,000 district students, or about 10% of the enrollment, are enrolled. It is costing the district $17 million to pay for the virtual learning program.